Hey guys, Sam here, welcome to another fantastic video on Pokemon Duel. Today we will take a look at the Grass Gym Cup, the event that's going on right now. And I will show you guys the deck that I put together uh, last minute in order for me to have some sort of success at this gym, which uh, got me my first two wins, so that's pretty nice. Uh, the deck that I'm going to show you right now is Grass Type. I want to make another video on uh, you know Poison deck, see if that's uh, you know pretty fun to run, especially with Tentacle, Venusaur, and uh, maybe some you know some other stuff. But right now, I will show you the first of two decks. This is actually a really nice rival to Re uh, to Reuniculus and Deoxys, which if you read the title, you know exactly what's going on. Um, my opponent right now has a Venusaur, Tentacruel, Tentacool, two Weezings, and a Mana Fee. You know that's uh, that's pretty odd. Uh, before we start, however, I do want to apologize for the game audio, it kind of corrupted or something, and I'm still, you know, uh, kind of improvising the setup for these videos, you know, I still don't have a place uh, properly set up for this, but hopefully you guys enjoy the content regardless. Uh, right now it's my opponent's turn, I will be speeding that up because he was pretty slow, uh, you know, kind of, kind of weird, but please run at least one runner in your deck, you know, it's uh, pretty painful to have uh, one of your uh, pieces set up at your entry point. I put up one of my uh, set tiles in the field, I got, you know, if you saw my previous video, you know that I got the two of them, and right out of the bat, I'm already challenging the game, this is, you know, pretty fun if he decides to attack, uh, you know, I am, um, I have a pretty good uh, matchup against either the Weezing or the Venusaur, he decides to gold block, which, you know, is, uh, you know, I guess kind of odd, it's still the best move, I put up my second set tile in order to threaten the other entry point. I do have uh, two hurdle jumps and one gold block for um, you know this entire deck and that's what I'll be running most of the time because obviously it's um, it's pretty broken. He decides to put, uh, to put his Tentacruel right there and right now I am threatening both the entry points. Um, if either piece moves, you know, I have a pretty nice uh, shot at taking both of them and he decides to go off uh, with the Tentacruel but he doesn't really attack which is you know, really odd. I use one of my hurdle jumps and then right away he is you know kind of a in a really, really, um, in a really awkward position because obviously, you know, you don't really have that much of a, you know, of a way to counter this movement uh, and all of the uh, versatility that you know this deck has. You know, all of my, well, uh, three of my pieces have three MP. Right now, I decide to use my second hurdle jump after he used his hurdle jump, and right now this is looking pretty grim for him uh, because the tentacle rule only has one movement. I go like, you know. This is this. Uh, this is actually looking pretty good. Hurdle jump for the double elimination, and right there he decides to X attack his Weezing, which you know is uh, kind of a good shot. But luckily, I get the blue attack, and that wins me the game. So uh, this was a pretty nice uh, first victory. I really, really have high expectations for my double septile. Um, right now, I believe that the best piece that you can have for this, um, not for this game, for this gym is the Ver, uh, Verizion, I'm not really sure the name of the other EX that is not Sceptile or Trevenant that you can get from the um, from the boosters. And right there I get my first uh, booster ticket, which is pretty nice. I think the rewards are pretty good, but you have um, to spend 40, ener uh, uh, yeah, spend, uh, 40 energy, uh, sorry my head scratch got me a little bit uh, knocked off, uh, but 40 energy for a game, you know, kind of a, a bit too much. Right now, triple Reuniclus, and I'm already on tilt. This, you know, kind of uh, hurts me so much to see, especially in the grass gym. I mean, this should kind of limit um, the uh, pieces that you, you know, can use. That is uh, for the gym. Maybe not really that much, but I go first. Uh, have kind of high expectations because both uh, my septiles have a pretty good matchup against the Reuniclus, and uh, I have kind of high hopes. Um, trying to stay positive here because obviously. Uh, if you play the game, Reuniclus is a um, piece of shit right now, let's just put it that way. Going up against the, the, um, the Ivysaur, uh, trying to proc the Venusaur uh, evolution, uh, we get the neutral matchup and I decide to hurdle jump and, well, threaten the game as well. The only thing he can do, which I, you know, would kind of do if, he, uh, you know, if I was him, put the Rayquaza, but, you know, that's not gonna happen. He is going to obviously open up with one of the Reuniclus, and right now, you know, I go like, yes, okay, Leaf Blade, but, you know, it was only one, uh, the 90 attack. Still, the um, Hyper Beam is, is the only thing that can knock me out, and unfortunately, unfortunately, that happens. He decides not to roll again, and, well, this is uh, looking uh, kind of bad for me. Decide to block the Ivysaur, obviously don't really want him to threaten um, you know, the game and if he moves up to my gold block, uh, to my entry point and I don't have anything, well that's uh, pretty much game over. 
decide to block with Venusaur because it's a really nice matchup and he decides to use um, a hurdle jump of his own. I was checking his plates right there. Uh, so he is threatening the game right there. I don't really have any means to get to my entry point other than gold block, so he makes me, um, you know, use that plate. So I'm, you know, kind of in a tight position right now. It's his turn. He can have three pieces up right now, and I only have uh, one, which is, uh, you know, really odd. Uh, thankfully, I, I do have my Torterra in case, you know, he decides to go for the entry point. I can set that up there and, you know, leave it for the rest of the game for my pieces to enter. Right now, he has a double Reuniclus on the field. He decides. Uh, to attack my Sceptile, yes, that's the case. I'm feeling pretty confident, but, uh, you know, once again, I only roll the 90, and of course, of course, that's gonna happen. Uh, if you run tri uh, Triple Reuniclus, please don't even touch the game. Uh, that's, um, that's pretty sad. I mean, he got, uh, you know, I wasn't really uh, paying attention to the game just with my little rant. Um, he, but, you know, he did pull out the Hyper Beam, which uh, is pretty sad. Uh, decide to go with my Leafion because it, you know, in case he decides to run with his uh, Reuniclus towards my entry space, that's um, going to put me in a really good position to end and threaten the game. So right now he puts his trip, he has, uh, his triple, his uh, third Reuniclus in that point. I decide to you know kind of uh, go for his entry point, which uh, in hindsight I don't really think that was a great idea, but I was like you know whatever. I don't really have high expectations at this point. I'm you know kind of tilted and uh, whatever. I do go for the 40 attack. This is really, really not going in my favor, but for some odd reason, um, this uh, is uh, going to start to turn around. It's really nice. Uh, my third figure is going to get knocked out right now. It's three to zero. This is not looking really good for me. And, you know, I'm just kind of thinking, what can I do? Uh, decide to use the, the second Venusaur for my, you know, to defend my entry point. And right there, he's just, uh, kind of, you know, starting to go all eights on me, like, you know, kind of uh, trying to go for my goal, uh, obviously, which is what you should, uh, you should be doing. Uh, decide to attack my Venusaur, and he rolls the uh, Confuse Rate into my uh, Poison Powder, or it's uh, Sleeping Powder, I'm not entirely sure, I think it's Sleeping. Uh, but I get confused, I decide to run my uh, Sceptile to where my uh, where my Lethion was, I was about to say, uh, where my Lethion is. Uh, decides to block the his entry point, uh, his entry space with Reuniclus, and I'm up uh, and I move. Uh, what is it with my stuttering today? I move one space in case he decides to go for the battle. I can dodge. Maybe I can use my second hurdle jump. But look at this, 150. There is no way he can win this right now, and um, this is starting to look pretty good because what I can now do, you know, in my mind, is like, well, like now I can use my second hurdle jump and threaten the game if he doesn't take out my. Um, you know, my Sceptile, which is pretty good. So right now, right away, use the second turtle jump, and I'm like, fuck yeah, this is starting to work out for me. Um, so right there, I use, uh, you know, both of the Reuniclus are out, uh, one uh, because of the battle, and the other one, uh, get the surround, which is pretty nice. The only thing he can do is, uh, you know, go for my Sceptile, and because there's no more bitch Reuniclus on the bench or the field, he only gets one, uh, I, I mean, he doesn't get any respins whatsoever, and that's what wins me the game. So, uh, overall, I'm pretty happy with this deck. I'm going to be back for another video when uh, I'm using a Poison deck. Right now, I am aiming to go for, uh, I have two mana feet, but I don't think that's really going to be um, a really good idea. Uh, what I'm aiming for is uh, to go for one mana feet, maybe run uh, four... A tentacle and of course one runner. I think it's gonna be uh, either Greninja or Sceptile. I'm not really sure. I'm gonna you know mix and match some of my pieces, but uh, yeah, I, I really do want to try that out. It seems like it's gonna be a lot of fun, uh, especially with a tentacle since it gets you know 60 attack uh, because of the bonus. You put it on the field, it gets 70, and that's just basically going to be pretty broken if you have more than 83. And especially with the mana piece. So right there, I open my box. I only get shit, but it doesn't matter. Got two wins. I'm pretty happy about that. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. And make sure to leave me your feedback in case you want to watch more videos like this. So again, thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.